This is a, a video showing our biodiesel fill station setup. Uh, you can see me and the, the other person is holding the camera there. Uh, I'm going to leave names out of this because this is about the biodiesel. Uh, it was hard for us to get this all set up at first because there wasn't a lot of uh, videos on YouTube or information on uh, how other people set up their biodiesel uh, fill stations. So we figured we'd uh, post it so other people can, uh, you know, get it done easier and start using the uh, biodiesel. So uh, I've got a IBC uh, food grade storage container here. It costs about a hundred bucks. It's pretty easy to find. And then our power source, we've got a solar right, panel. We're here outside. It is dusk right now. I said it's going to be hard to see. We'll try to take a picture of it and uh, get it up there with um, the description. But that's our uh, solar panel. It's actually an old uh, um, dish network uh, mount with the solar panel on the very end. It's kind of hard to see, but if you follow the lines back, you can see there's our positive and negative, and that's Inside our power it station. Runs. It's connected to the battery controller, and then that's hooked up to that uh, long cycle battery there. The pump we chose was a 12 volt DC pump. Uh, it's, uh, it runs really well. It's kind of loud, but not too loud. Then uh, our piping is just a regular 3 quarter inch black pipe. Then we've got a uh, fuel meter. And then last, it runs through our goldenrod um, filter. We used a uh, polyurethane hose that's uh, reinforced. That's pretty much the setup. Um, you can see the links below the video. We'll go ahead and uh, have those. And uh, also, yeah, People's Fuel is who we get our fuel from. We live, uh, uh, you know, the Sacramento area here in California, and they're uh, they're pretty close to us. The whole setup here cost us in equipment about 600 bucks. Uh, this is an almost 300 gallon tank. Lasts us about three to four months between the two of us. Uh, so it's pretty convenient. So hopefully, uh, you get your setup and good luck.